Welcome everyone to this video. Today we are testing the free version of Bitdefender Antivirus and I do have a folder with a bunch of samples of malware, 460 samples in total. We will be using these samples to see how well Bitdefender does or does not do as far as protecting us against these specific threats. The procedure will be as follows. In a moment I will enable the real-time protection here in Bitdefender. We'll let it sit for a few minutes to see if it can detect anything on its own after which we will run a system scan, and then if there's any samples remaining, we will scan the samples folder directly. If there's any remaining after that, we will execute them and see if the real-time protection can stop them. Please note, Bitdefender is up to date. At this point, we will go ahead and enable. We do have all the default settings turned on and we'll go ahead and let it sit for just a few minutes. So far nothing has popped up. Let's double check our samples folder. We're still sitting at 460. So at this point let's go ahead and initiate a system scan. And we will let this continue until it's fully completed. The scan has completed and it found 449. These ones were resolved. Here's a list of everything that it found. We're going to set this one to delete and then continue. Now there are 10 results remaining in the samples folder. However, it is requesting a restart. So we're going to go ahead and do that first before we see what the results are. After restart, we are down to just nine results. And so at this point, we're going to scan the samples folder directly. and it did not detect anything additional. So at this point, let's go ahead and execute the remaining samples. After execution, we're down to just eight samples. And so at this point, we're going to restart one more time and run some second opinion scans. After restart, I ran a scan with malware bytes, which came back with five results detected. And so we're going to go ahead and now that they're quarantined, do another restart. Ran a scan with MZSoft, which came back clean, no results detected. We still have three samples remaining in our samples folder. I did upload those three remaining samples here to VirusToll just to double check to make sure that those were legitimate samples. And this is the first one, second one, and the third one. That's everything for this test, but please keep in mind that this is just one type of test and Bitdefender very well may perform differently in other types of tests. Regardless, you can take these results and draw your own conclusions. But if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please consider sharing it. If you have any comments or questions, please post them down below. If you'd like to support the channel, go ahead and hit that thanks button, the join button, or the subscribe button, or even that bell notification to get notifications on future videos. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a great day.